the given expression is 1 plus 2x divided by 1 minus x plus x square. Now multiply the numerator and denominator of this expression by 1 plus x. Note that the denominator is equal to 1 plus x cube and the numerator is equal to 2x square plus 3x plus 1. And therefore, the given expression can be written as 1 plus 3x plus 2x square multiplied by 1 plus x cube whole raised to the power minus 1. And this is equal to 1 plus 3x plus 2x square multiplied by the binomial expansion of 1 plus x cube whole raised to the power minus 1 which is 1 minus x cube plus x raised to the power 6 minus x raised to the power 9 plus and so on plus minus raised to the power m minus 1 multiplied by x raised to the power 3m minus 3 plus minus raised to the power m multiplied by x raised to the power 3m plus and so on. Now note that the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m is equal to the product of the constant term in the first component multiplied by the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m in the second component which is equal to minus raised to the power m. Similarly, the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m plus 1 is equal to the product of the coefficient of x in the first component multiplied by the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m in the second component and this is equal to 3 times minus raised to the power m. Similarly, the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m plus 2 is equal to the product of the coefficient of x square in the first component multiplied by the coefficient of x raised to the power 3m in the second component and this is equal to 2 times minus raised to the power m. Therefore, in the first case, when n is of the form 3m or m is equal to n upon 3, then the required coefficient is equal to minus raised to the power m which is equal to minus raised to the power n upon 3. Similarly, if n is equal to 3m plus 1 or m is equal to n minus 1 upon 3, then the required coefficient is equal to 3 times minus raised to the power m which is equal to 3 times minus raised to the power n minus 1 upon 3. And finally, if n is equal to 3m plus 2, or m is equal to n minus 2 upon 3, then the required coefficient is equal to 2 times minus raised to the power m, which is equal to 2 times minus raised to the power n minus 2 upon 3. Therefore, to summarize, the coefficient of x raised to the power n is minus raised to the power n upon 3 when n is of the form 3m is equal to 3 times minus raised to the power n minus 1 upon 3 if n is of the form 3m plus 1 and finally the required coefficient is equal to 2 times minus raised to the power n minus 2 upon 3 if n is of the form 3m plus 2 and this is the required result.